this is a video about how to orient the smart table if your touch is off a little bit. We're here at the student menu. So I'm going to plug in a USB stick into the side to get to the teacher menu. Here in the teacher menu, I'm going to see various options. And what we're going to start with is orient, which is up at the top there. You shouldn't have to do this very often. It's only when there are some issues with smart uh, in the table that you want to be able to solve. Uh, this is important. Uh, you want to make sure it's away from direct sunlight and it says to close the cabinet doors that's on the table securely. That's just so the projector is stable and the direct sunlight can bounce off the top of the table and cause some issues. So I'm going to press OK and we're going to orient. This looks like your smart board. The difference is you have to press and hold and then you hear a beep when it's time to move on to the next one once the green circle has made it all the way around. The more accurate you are, the more accurate the touch is going to be for the students. This is different. We have to slide into the corner. Again, the more accurate you can get into those corners, the more the table will know about your range of touch. And that's the orientation all done. Again, you should not have to do this very often, only when uh, you've had a big jostle or you've repositioned the camera on the inside and you just need to remind the table where the touch is. I'm going to unplug the USB stick and that gets me back to the student menu. So now the student should be able to come and touch on the screen. Match the colors. And this will be more accurate now. Blue. Let's say we want to exit this activity. My X is in the corner. Now have better touch. And that's how you orient your smart table.